because I was just like, fuck the world. Like, not like, I need a break. Like, honestly, like, fuck all of you. Like, everybody and everything, and I don't like doing anything anymore. Like, nothing makes me happy. I don't like anyone. I even told one of my therapists at one point, I said, I just don't want to feel anything. None of us are immune um, from, you know, just shit happening to, to you, you know? And not to you, but just kind of making poor choices or being human. There's, there's always that element. And for me, life got really weird and really hard all at one time. There was a few times over the last couple of years where I was just like kind of like ready to throw in the towel um, and just kind of give up on everything. But I found that for me, most of my suffering is self-inflicted. It's not like it's coming from some external source that's making me feel that way. No one can make you feel anything. It's, it's what you think about in your, internally that makes you feel things. Like you are the only person that makes you feel anything. And so I know that I have this pattern of getting into these kinds of thoughts and these kinds of you know, actions and choices. I've always had these kind of depressive, this depressive side. And I think that's something some people may not have gone down the road of like injecting and like living on the streets and like, you know, that kind of stuff. And so they think like, oh, my story's not that bad. <laughs> right. It's like, dude, no, man. Like, if you if you're here, it's as bad as if you're just... here, it's that bad. There's nothing special about that guy who's been living on the streets and the person who's just like binge drinker uh, three times a month. Your life's fucked up, and you realize that there's something you got to do about it, and it's just as hard on either end. But each one is just as relevant as the next. And you don't have to know somebody to have an intimate experience with them. And it also, you don't have to like know someone to feel safe enough to talk to them any group of people can get together and just be like hey we're gonna get real in here like let's get real and just be vulnerable say whatever's going on and like be accepted walk out of the